and power fluctuations for more intel. Avenger plotting wanna... new course. I have enough intel now, but to uh, take this while it's here it only takes five days. Mm, Wheatley. New ability Insanity. Debilitating telepathic attack that can inflict different negative conditions, including mental control of the target. No fat chance. Alright, carry on. So I could use him now. Ah. Okay, so that just brings me there. Uh, you soldiers. Yeah, that's a Psyamp there. Okay, plasma rifle. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You have the advanced auto loader, right? Yeah. And a superior scope. The few, do you have any uh the blah? No. There you go. Now you do. And Urs is only out for four days. So, check into you, soldier abilities. Depending on who you ask, psionics could be considered the alien's greatest strength. Now our own psi operatives can tap into that same power. Can earn promotions and learn new abilities by continuing to train at the Psy Lab. Operatives can still participate in all combat missions while training. Ah. And will automatically resume training if they res return from combat uninjured. Ah. Okay. Okay, so, okay, stasis, stuns a target for a turn, renders them immune to any damage or attack. Hmm. Okay. Could be useful for, uh, as a way to anybody who's got a buff going on, like a sectoid, one of those mind melt things, stasis them. It's as effective as this flashbang. Could also be useful for controlling overwatches. If you got two dudes, you want to make sure you overwatch this guy, you stun the other one. Gain a bonus action immediately to a nearby squad mate. Bonus action, not the bonus movement. Bonus action, which means shooting. Or shizzle. Insanity does a small amount of guaranteed damage and applies rupture to the target. What? I imagine I'm eventually going to get a lot of cool things that I can use against aliens, so let's pick up Inspire while we can. A bonus action immediately to a nearby squad mate. I could see that being incredibly useful in a lot of different situations. Cool. And he can still be used during battle, which is nice. Huh. So Shadow Chamber. No, not Shadow Chamber. God damn it. Psylab. Hmm. It's just weird because it had three things on there, but he's got... Just two to choose from. Inspire has a three turn cooldown. Squad only supposed to be within their sight radius, but line of sight's not required. Oh, so that's what I'm unlocking right now, or, okay, so it's either one, two, three. Got it? Question mark? Hmm, <clears throat> okay. Do I have anything for a weapon upgrade for you? The hair trigger? Sure, why not? <laughs> I don't have any PCS for you, unfortunately. Facilities. Operation Massive Sleep. Okay. That's not that far away. It's like a New India bang. Head up there. Bang. That's two in one month. That'd be nice. Keep doing this though. Get that intel. Commander. The aliens are still moving forward on the Avatar project. 
Taking out that facility would deal a serious blow to their efforts. Priority message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. I bet he says they did shit because their avatar project increased so much even though it all happened just now. It is unfortunate, Commander, that your recent efforts have proven to be so mediocre. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, two of those and one of those all happened, like, this day. And he's like, you did a shit job this entire month. You're terrible. It's mediocre. We expected better from you. It's like, <laughs> fuck you, guy. Dr. Holly Davies and Captain Kenji Nakano. Hmm. Ooh. That sounds poop. Next retaliation strike imminent. Estimated. Okay, well. 40 intel to reveal. Fuck, well, Viper Rounds is pretty terrible, so, uh. I think probably that one we'll be countering. Ignore that for now. Finish this up. Predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. Ward and armor, and then the proving ground things: wraith suit and war suit. Presumably upgrades for the. Pause and read that if you'd like. Presumably those are upgrades for these suits that I've yet to actually build, because I just never get around to it. Ward and armor, that'll be the next tier. Illyrium powered armor provides unprecedented survivability and versatility. Versatility, eh? New heavy suit. Defensive force field. Ah. Psionic field enmeshed in a specially designed light armor, light armor suit. What? Okay. Well, let's get that autopsy going. As initially speculated by Shen, it does in fact appear that this creature is restricted to the confines of its own hulking environmental suit. Unfortunately for our troops, the suit itself is a powerful physical threat, regardless of the operator's status, as we learned with some astonishment in the field. Not sure exactly what that'll do for me. And what else do we got going on? There's something else I was going to do. Engineering, Commander. the armor. Yep, squad upgrade 300 supplies. 40 alleys is no problem. 20 Illyrium crystals is no problem. Jesus. But, I mean, damn. It's, yep. Mm -hmm. This is our basic power armor frame. Providing the durability you'd expect from a giant armored suit. That's all you have to say about it, huh? You couldn't have had them, like, in the firing range with Shen with, like, a machine gun and just, like, unloading a clip into somebody and they're just shrugging it off. Oh, come on. Two psych dude corpses, 77. That's all of my supplies. But... <clears throat> nah, hold off on it. All those people, millions of innocent lives unknowingly walking right into the alien's trap. We should have realized sooner. We knew the aliens couldn't be trusted. But their message has always been louder than ours. And they've certainly got a lot more incentives to offer in the city centers than we do out here. Either way, we can't let this go on, no matter what the cost. Was it I had seven comms, or does this just give you one and then you put somebody in there and you get plus two? I thought I was at 5 to 7. Oh well, no matter. Doesn't change the plan. Finish this. Strategic ah. resource located. 54 intel. It's really not that much. I know it. Three Avenger days. Do this now. And then we head over to Europe. And bang out some contacts. Ah, fuck, really? Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Commander, we're almost Shut out of up, time. Shut up, Central. The Avatar God. project is entering its final stages. The only way we're going to slow the Avatar project is by destroying one of their facilities. We have to move fast or everything we've worked towards will be lost. I know it. They've gained like plus four over the course of a week. The fuck? 
And they've got that threat continue training. Okay, so I can pick up all of them. Okay, sure. Immediately damages everything. Organic enemies have a chance to suffer insanity. Ah! Go for the big one first. Sure thing. Back to the bridge. What? Enemy unknown. A heavy mag, an elite trooper, and an event shield bear. Got something new. Operation Demon Tooth. Well, I have to do this. For the which means European those supplies are going to have to sit for a little bit. And while I'm over here, I think I have to make contact with people because we got a wicked countdown going. Uh, so how much health do we have? This armor. Plus six. Dang. Yeah, it's plus two. And actually gives you plus one armor as well. Hmm. Pretty neat stuff. God, you look strange though. Ugh. Shiny. Very shiny. Two snipers, that'll be useful. The Skulljack on Gambit. Hey, keep up. Giving Wheatley a trial. And Little Me is medic. Yeah. We don't have a heavy anymore. That's the problem. We'll try it. Menace 1 5. Hostile forces are attacking the outpost. Eliminate all enemy units and protect those civilians. Advent came in hot, and so did we. You won't have a concealed position for deployment on this one. So, two things. One, the frame going to be a little bit poop on this mission because the water is heavily affecting it, and there's, of course, no graphics options to modify the water at all whatsoever. <sighs> because reasons. So, um, we're just going to have to bear through it. It's not too terrible, though. But we did start on what seems to be really high ground, which is kind of a cool thing. Um, I'm not really sure what to do with this, though, because it's one of those missions where you go, go, go and save civilians, and I don't know where any civilian... I know where a civ... two civilians are. Uh, one there, and I think there's a second one there, maybe? A little bit? One of them's probably a trap, though. So... yeah, I'm not really sure. <sighs> Oops, that was the one I wanted. Uh, I keep up. Have you run up there? See what there's to see in the world? Not really sure what to do if I should take advantage of this high ground and camp here with maybe just snipers. I'm getting the feeling I'm going to be fighting crystals this mission because there's an unknown alien after that crystalphobia project. Uh, I don't know. Uh, get you. That'll work. I don't really want to go over to that far edge. I don't know what's over there. This map is pretty huge. Mind you, it's rather large in this direction. Ugh. Ugh. As well as this direction, it's not too terribly large, but, you know. Still big enough where you could hide a pod back there, though. So, we'll leave that end of the map as whatever, and just work our way over to these civilians. I didn't see anything, so we should be okay. Exile, you're a sniper, so hang out up here. And just pistol hey, overwatch. And Wheatley, get you... I hey, guess you can head down there, too, along with Gambit. There you go, everybody's on here. Out. It's a party, so we'll leave the snipers up top and move everybody else out. Something going on off to the right. But I don't know what. Oh no, Jose Rodriguez. Shut up, Central. Whoever thought it was a good idea to have you talk all the time whenever possible should be fired. Yeah, that looked like chrysalid almost. Uh, 
not little me. Judith first. Okay, here first to save them. Okay. Uh. Don't do that, camera. It's about to click to move. She's like, ah, camera jerks moves your position. Uh. So you end up running into a really stupid spot. And I guess, since it seems clear up here, can I get you up to the civilian? Yes, I can. I can't tab though. That's a problem. Oh my god. These chrysalids seem a little smaller than I remember. Then again, it was never really their size we had to worry about. Okay. And like nobody can see them. Absolutely. Skid up with you, they're nice and clumped together. Acid bomb. Can't see them from anywhere over there. Uh, you can see a couple from here. Okay, so maybe. You guys can't really see anybody. We would need to move you guys up a lot, I think. Or, since Chris lids, uh, we all move together. Could do that too. Hold off for now. Yeah, let's do that. Come on down. You can't throw that. F oh my god, you almost can. Jesus, your arm is insane. Do we still have... No. Let's hope we still had Inspire. You can move a little more. Okay, well, only a couple of us can actually see them, so you're just gonna have to pistol overwatch. You're gonna have to pistol overwatch. Leaving just little me. We can kill him. Acid might kill the other two. Maybe. No, not enough. Alright. Some dude just camping on top of the building, killing all the civilians. Great. Oh shit. You guys are gonna move up and observe the pistol overwatch, aren't you? No, your range isn't good enough. Good. And the chrysalids didn't do anything? 